What's something you can't believe you had to explain to another adult? Was tipped a $20 bill to be spilt between myself and a coworker. I handed her $10 I had in my pocket and took the $20. She said it wasn't fair that I had $20 and she only had $10. I tried to explain to her that I already had the $10, so another $10 equaled $20. She couldn't wrap her head around it, insisting I was trying to rip her off. She gave me back the 10 bucks, took the 20 to her register and made change of two $10 bills. As she hands me mine I showed her that now I still have $20 and she has $10. But somehow she was satisfied she'd thwarted my attempts to shortchange her. Needless to say I didn't stay friends with her after that. This is made all the more ridiculous by the fact that she had once told me she was forced to repeat grade 12 math class because she got 100% and the teacher accused her of cheating. The following year she got 98%. I'm thinking something fishy is going on there. Reminds me of the video where the woman claims something like she would eat an entire pizza cut into 4 slices. But not if it was cut into 8 because 8 is more than 4. The guy kept trying to explain that it's one whole pizza either way. In regards to the north and south poles, neither is the one that is always hot. I guess they were thinking about the equator. Yes sir, when you sign up for insurance you're agreeing to pay for it. I once had to explain to a college friend that Indians didn't have spices running in their blood that allows them to eat spicier food. On the contrary, I had a college friend who is Indian and he tried to convince one of our other friends that he did have spices in his blood. Why a room below sea level on a cruise ship would not have a balcony? A balcony bubble would be pretty cool terrifying. That no matter how much you might want to put a camo pattern on your walls, you, not the paint have to determine what that pattern looks like and you will also have to purchase multiple cans of paint tinted differently because camo doesn't come out of a can that way. Should have convinced him that a single can of olive drab would do the trick and then when he complains, gaslight him by saying that it's working because he can't see it. That oil isn't easier to get in the Middle East because you only have to drill through sand. Turn off the high beams for cars traveling in the opposite direction. I had to explain to my friend that the earth wasn't a thousand and nineteen years old. Happy birthday to the ground. There are more than six bones in the human body. She thought it was head, back, arms and legs. Had to explain to my wife that pickles were made of cucumbers. She didn't believe me, still not sure she does. Ask her if she can buy you some pickle seeds. You want to grow some next spring. Told my roommate that if he cooked food on less than the highest level of heat, he wouldn't burn as much food, and would generally have more success. A week later, I explained to him that when he was just boiling water, high heat was okay. That earth has one moon. The new moon on the calendar every month confused her. That Halloween has never and will never fall on Friday the 13th. It was my mom. Experience this, it was my aunt. She had some meme that said Halloween that year was the first one to fall on Friday 13th in 666 years or some ridiculous crap like that. I had to explain to my mother that muscles are meat. A piece of meat was tough, and so I must have said something about what part of the cow the muscle came from. No, we weren't eating muscles, we were eating meat. She was sickened by the concept that anyone would eat muscles. Somehow this got to the point of her claiming that humans didn't have any meat on them because they aren't food. I did not win that argument. Humans have no meat. Meat is not muscles. Period. Oh. It turns out people are not part of the animal kingdom either. It was a dismal childhood. And there comes that stop disrespecting me part when someone younger starts winning an argument. I had to explain to a teacher, in front of her class, that a penguin was a bird. I didn't want to be like that but she was adamant that if it didn't fly, it wasn't a bird. I had a teacher saying that dinosaur was the biggest mammal to ever exist. 1. Dinosaur isn't a single species. 2. Dinosaurs aren't mammals. 3. Blue whales are bigger. When a smart bomb strikes a building and blows it up, it doesn't just kill the bad guys, it kills everyone in the building. Smart only means it's going to hit the building instead of a random location. Smart bomb goes off, kills all the terrorists and the guy who lit it 20 minutes ago. Don't bring your dog to work and let her pee poop on the carpet, 
Tiny poop and little puddles are not decay just because they are tiny. She weighs 4 pounds. He said she's so little it doesn't matter. He said he never even notices at home and if I had a dog, I'd feel differently. Have a dog. Still don't want urine and fesses in my carpet, at home or at work. My mother told me nobody can live on $40,000 USD a year, and I was unable to get her to understand that it is pretty normal to make $40,000 or less and people do fine with that salary. My friend worked at Office Depot and had to explain to a customer why he couldn't make him photocopies of a $20 bill. Oh, of course you can just photocopy $20 bills. I just slave here answering stupid questions for you because I enjoy the human interaction. Well, sir, it's not illegal to serve food that tastes bad. No, this isn't a police issue. The drinks have caloric content. A co-worker was complaining how she was having trouble losing weight and didn't realize drinking 4 hot chocolates a day was not really conducive to weight loss. Canada is part of North America. Pretty much anything geography related. Most people are simply terrible at knowing where things are even within their own local regions. We had to explain to someone that islands don't tip over if you put too much weight on the edge. Hey hey hey, if you can get enough penguins to dance or jackhammer on the edge, anything is possible. As a server, there are so many times I have to explain to guests that chicken can't be cooked medium rare. I won't get salmonella, this is chicken, not salmon. No, you should not perform an auto vasectomy at home, you should see a doctor for that. She's an educator. It was one of those days where Mars was super bright. She was super sure the moon was Mars. And suddenly it was super visible and close to Earth. Like, it came super close and fricked back off overnight. Boo. Mars. Press up when you want to go up in the elevator and down if you want to go down. She thought you had to guess where the elevator was and if it was under you let's say. You had to press up. To make pasta you have to boil the water. That dinosaurs existed, and that the king and I is not the story of Moses. My dad had like 6 or 7 paid recurring charges for internet p and a lot of malware on his computer. I had to explain free p to my 67 year old dad. So, that was something. My wife and I had to explain to the neighbor that our dog is part of our family, and no they can't just have him. Their kids wanted our dog, which was cute, until the mother also decided that she wanted our dog and it was only fair that they got to have him on the weekends because we get to have him all week long. This happened to a friend of mine. It got to the point of this family taking the dog out of their yard while they were at work and then be seen taking it on walks a few days later in the same neighborhood. They ended up having to move the dog to her mum's place several suburbs over. You shouldn't iron your clothes while you're wearing them. One guess as to how this came up. That power tools need to be turned on in order to work. I work with this guy who thinks that average precipitation us. Like, some sort of quota that nature is obliged to meet. For example, if it's a particularly dry summer, he thinks it will just rain a lot in the last few days before summer ends. Look at that genius Mithafrika he just solved climate change. Don't worry farmers I know it hasn't rained in 5 years and all your crops are dead natures like, required to give you more rain to make up for it. There's a girl I used to work with who didn't know submarines actually existed. PSSSHHHTTT. Next you'll be telling me there are rocket ships that can take man to the moon, get out of here. That the North Pole is an actual place on the planet and not just a mythical place where Santa and his elves live. Also had to explain that the South Pole is real. Granted, they did not think Santa is real, but they also didn't believe me flat out about the poles. They first argued saying I was crazy and then googled it. You can still get diarrhea even if you believe in Jesus. Well, there's my new t-shirt. That Australia and India do not share a border. New Mexico is a state. You have no idea the number of people that believe we are a part of Mexico. That you can't get AIDS through intercourse if you don't already have the HIV virus inside your body or your partner is carrying it. 
A guy I talked to once thought that gay men got AIDS simply by having intercourse, and that the disease just spontaneously appeared through the act of interanal insemination. I don't even think that he understood the concept of a virus. I was flying back home from overseas with a friend, and I said something about how it was a bummer we couldn't bring fresh produce back. She asked why we couldn't, and I explained you weren't allowed to bring plants when flying crossing borders. She thought it was absurd that I would consider a piece of produce, for example, an avocado or mango, to be a plant. It became a pretty heated argument. It's not a plant it's food. Had to explain to someone in college that 3 seconds of dish soap was not necessary for each plate you wash, as in he would turn the dish soap upside down, and squeeze for 1, 2, 3, 4, each, plate. That I couldn't just go to the bathroom and pee my period out to be done with it, he was about 19 stroke 20 at the time and obviously didn't have sex education, been married 25 years, he will never live that down. 6 inches isn't 0.6 of a foot, she had been slowly, unknowingly, overcharging our company for materials for years. Unknowingly. How to use a new type of electric hand drying machine, mounted on the wall, in a public men's room. The guy tried everything to make it work, other than following the simple instructions on the hand dryer, it even had arrows pointing the way where his hands should be inserted to activate it. I was in a truck stop restroom at the end of the working day and was really tired, so more and more places now have the auto sinks where you put your hands under it and the water starts. I'm waving my hands under the faucet and loudly complaining about how those things never work. The guy washing up beside me, reached over and turned the water on for me. Thanks for watching. If you are new to the channel, you can subscribe. I publish new videos every day. Until then, check another video, or don't. Either way, have a great day you magnificent people.